It's working! Oh my goodness, this is epic. Dude, this is actually gonna work! I can't believe it, we're geniuses. We are total geniuses. What's up guys, it's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. That's right, playing here on the Alpha Tribe server with Extinction Core, baby. So excited, doing flips. Man, oh man, guys, thank you so very much for coming, hanging out, joining me on the adventures. As you always do, please remember, Show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button. That's right. And if you're new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe for the daily arc awesomeness. Man, oh man, speaking of awesome. Last episode, we got this most amazing and awesome alpha dialo. That's right. It is a total knockout artist and probably our strongest creature yet. It is so very cool. So we're gonna grab you. And today I wanna work on hopefully getting another cool team, maybe another alpha, but I also wanna get the Extinction Core workbench. And as you can see, it cost, we got the obsidian last episode, but it cost 60 prime hide, which you get from getting Extinction Core dinos. We'll just, we'll leave it at that. Thus far to my name, I swore I had more than this, but it looks like I got 35 prime hide. So we need to get more of it. We need to get more. Um, we likely can hunt down the prime dodos, but they don't drop very much. You get like every so often like one or two from them. The alphas is where they're really at. So we'll have to go hunting down more alphas, which will be pretty cool. They got a lot of good drops, including all of the crazy crystals that they drop. We also got a more upgraded Pteranodon, which we haven't really put too many levels into yet. So I probably should get a going on that. It's hitting for 10,000, it's not bad. No slouch, that is for dang sure. But anyway, pretty exciting. Um, also, just in general, we need to find more resources and get more good stuff. To bring us on our way we got teleporters last episode which is a huge lifesaver and check this out oh i don't even know bro is that even something we can consider uh, that would be, that would make me so happy if we could get something like that we can't bola the alpha pteranodon so i mean that is they're pretty difficult oh crap i did not mean to do that crap Oh, well, that one. Oh, you know what? They heal up pretty quick. I forget about this. Yeah, see? It's healing up pretty quick. There's a chance maybe our Dillo would actually be able to knock it out. But, yeah, they're generally speaking pretty difficult to get. Although, it would be a huge upgrade. All right, all right. You know what? I'm, I'm really thinking I want to try it. All right, what's going on? He's still scared of me. You see that orange outline? So we just gotta wait until he's no longer scared because otherwise they are quick. They're super quick. Usually the best way to get them is when they get stuck on something. So I don't know, we'll follow him for a little bit. We'll see what's up. I mean, it could be cool. Unfortunately in Extinction Core, you don't have like an Anunnaki where there's like the poison pteranodons and stuff like that. There's not too many creatures they can do torpor, especially, I can't think of any that do it while flying. So yeah, there's that. Anyway, let's just wait for this guy to kind of chill out. Um, It is possible to passive team, I believe. I believes, I believes, but it's kind of early on for us to even attempt that or think much about that. All right, he's kind of chilling right now. Let's Let's try this, let's just see. I mean, you never know until you try. I have not put much for levels into this Dillo yet, especially into the attack. Please tell me that's the one. And I have no idea what's over here. I could just be running into a trap. Oh man, Froggy Man had a real hard time yesterday. He actually lost the Dillo that uh, that we tamed together. Uh-oh, Skeletal. Yikes, kind of scary, kind of scary. All right, let's toss that back off. Pick him back up, This this might take a while. This may not be worthwhile this early on. Look at that skeletal dude. 
That is so cool. Oh no. And I've seen a couple of tribesmen. They can spawn up by our base, which is pretty scary. All right, come on, come on, buddy bro. That's the same one. He's already completely healed up all the damage that we did to him, so that's cool. That is a very cool. All right, I'm gonna keep on following him just for a little bit, see what happens. See if maybe I can get a good opportunity to smack him. But chances are, it's just not in our cards yet. So, we'll see. Right, all right, maybe, maybe, come on. Get him, get him. Oh, I think, did I even hit him, bro? I don't even think I hit him. What the crap? All right, guys, we got a level 60 Alpha Pteranodon. This one, I, I think, I'm, I'm cutting away from the other guy. I wanna see if we can actually just get this guy for his hide. Come here, bro. How are we doing? Oh yeah, he's almost done. Come here, come here. Spin, yes, beautiful. And let's get that hide. Come on, ooh. Man, it's a squiggle wiggle. All right, did that give hide? Oh, I think our Dillo got him. All right, I was thinking of another good idea. The Dillo's on my shoulder. If I could fly up next to that, that other Alpha Pteranodon and then get the Dillo to attack him, I mean, that could potentially be a way. I've been having problems with my whistles lately, though, so I'm not sure what the deal is. Come on. Oh, if he would just shoot his gunk at him, that would be amazing. Come here, bro. Come here. Yeah, he is just not doing it. Come on. Oh, man. Yeah, I don't even know why that hasn't been working. Oh, crap. He's going by that dragon again. All right, moving away. What do we got here? Is that an alpha parasaur? That would be easy hide. All right, that's cool. Ooh, and you know what? I never even considered that. Um, Mantis would actually be amazing for getting polymer, the organic polymer, for sure. So that's cool. All right, that gave us three prime hide. All right, not bad. We're moving along. Is it dangerous here? All right, I just want to pop off first. Whoa. Did you just see that? Whoa, Raptor. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, phew. Saved my butt, bro. Saved my butt. All right, let's just look in his inventory. Yep, and he got 11 prime hide from getting that Pteranodon, so that's pretty cool. And he was on attacking targets, so I don't even know why that wasn't working. But anyway, moving on, moving on. Let's just get more of the hide. Let's get that table made. All right, there's another alpha right there. Not sure what level it is. Let's get you pumped up. What the heck level are you? 200, can can that be a problem? Oh yeah, I bet we could get this guy. Just because we have flight and we can get away in time. All right, almost done. All right. Bam, almost done and final hit. Come on, spin. That's the other big thing about having an alpha. Ooh, is that another alpha? Or is that a normal one? Come here, bro. All right, let's just see what's in this bag. The alpha pteranodons, I think, will spin easier. They'll spin more often. There's not as much of a cooldown, so that's pretty cool. All right, do we have in total enough yeah i think we do we have just barely enough to make that table so why don't we teleport back to the base spawn base and let's go make the workbench all right guys we are back at the base we've got 70 some odd of the hide so that's cool we should be able to make the workbench now and bada boom beautiful 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 now i was thinking about other things to do with this pteranodine like what to do and i do recall now there's some type of helmet like a carnivore and an herbivore helmet that would make you i think like invisible until you actually um hit them to carnivores or herbivores i think that's how that worked but um yeah is something I couldn't find in the Ingrams anymore, so it might be something we actually got a battle for. Um, but let's just see, of the stuff that I've unlocked so far, we have the healing, the oxygen, and the fortitude vials, okay, which does the stamina. There is a grappling hook from this mod that's an infinite grappling hook, cool. I did unlock the Trinidon saddle. We also have sedative, narcotic, and detox, awesome. 
Um, we had better drink ammo? I think... I think this is a better one. All right, well, to check that out. And then we also have compound ones. These are the ones that we want to use for bosses. But we got to be able to get Megalina Toxin and all sorts of other goodies. There's also normal shock darts. Which, again, you know what? I think these are upgraded changed ones for this mod. So, I don't know. Interesting. We'll have to look into it. Um, I guess I'm at the level now where I can do a long neck. Let's just see. Long, yeah, you know what? Maybe it's time that we upgraded and tried out some different darts. This might be the smart way of doing things. So, let's see. Do we have plenty? We should have plenty of stuff. Can we get... Oh, of course. And it messes up our upgrade. All right, so I might make... Ooh, this is a good one. Oh, lordy, that's a really good one. All right, we lucked out there. Um, But then we got to get all the other shenanigans to make a whole bunch of darts. Um, We got to make gunpowder and whatnot. Um, On that note, why don't we go ahead and get some more bulk stuff unlocked? So let's go ahead and get the bulk grinder. Epic. And that's going to require this as well. Epic. And this is going to be important because the uh, mortar and pe uh, pestle is pretty slow. This one does five at a time. So it's a huge upgrade from that guy. So why don't we grab this out of you, bro? Let's get you picked up. Beautiful. And let's get this new one set in because it's just going to be so far superior. All right, sweet, and it's unpowered until we put down the anvil, which we can hide right behind it. All right, perfect, perfect, perfect. All right, so what do we have for charcoal? Do we have that much? Nah, yeah, I guess we got enough. So let's go ahead, grab that, let's grab this, let's grab all the shenanigans that we need to grind up for this stuff. Awesome. And let's get a whole bunch of spark powder made, and then we can upgrade the spark powder into gunpowder. Awesome. All right, so we got five at a time. Beautiful. All right, this is going to be so much faster. So let's get some darts made up, too. I just think it's going to be the smarter way of doing things. All right, guys, making progress, making progress. Just wanted to show you. So we got to hope these are different darts than vanilla darts. They might just be the vanilla darts i don't know but we're gonna go ahead and make the shocking trank darts i think that would actually be huge so we've got enough to do at least a hundred of these so that's pretty cool and let's just see other other things oh oh before i forget um let's make some of the augment stations the add-ons let's see so we have an app for a blueprint station uh or that is called the blueprint station but add-ons for the upgrade station so let's go ahead and make both of those, the augment and the blueprint. Cause I want to make a blueprint of our long neck. Cause like I said, the long neck that we got without augmenting it, it's really good. 700, I mean, 750, I think would maybe be the max, but yeah, we might get even better if we make a blueprint of it. Plus I'm sure Frogman will want one. So let's go ahead, create blueprint, sweet. We get a lot of the resources back and let's stick it back in here hopefully we have the resources to craft this Ooh, that is pricey now oh no all right i gotta cook up more metal now my goodness um got a bunch of rare flowers from the froggy mac kibble station um let's go ahead cook up more metal yikes this is getting so pricey i'm gonna have to go out and get more wood now but at least we'll get more charcoal all right, sweet. So let's let the metal cook. Let me get some more wood. Um, and we're gonna use these trank darts, see how they do. But if those end up not doing well, I mean, there really needs to be an in-between for it. We can always go to, is it under tools? We do have these darts right here, which would be much better too, and we could also make. So that might be a possibility as well. We'll try them both, and that way we'll have two long necks to do, to do both. 
I think it should work out pretty well. Anyway, I'll see you guys back once we got all that stuff done. My goodness, so pricey. So I think for now, we're only gonna be able to afford to make the one we already had and we didn't get any better with the blueprint, but that's okay. That is a-okay with me. So we're gonna throw in the shocking drink darts on it. So that's cool. Let's go ahead and get it loaded up. Nice. And I went ahead, we can just manually switch the darts on the same weapon, that is just fine. Um, making up these darts too. So we'll see how those go, we got more in the works crafting. So super sweet. So we're doing pretty good guys, we are doing pretty dang good. Getting my health up, I am quite healthy now. Very nice. Do we have anything else in this machine? Ah, that rock keeps growing back, we gotta adjust that. Anyway, um, yeah, let's go out on the hunt. Um, we definitely need to harvest more primal resources and whatnot, but I'd also like to get either another prime or alpha tame. Um, a Tranodon would be epic, a raptor would be amazing, any of these things, really, I'd be quite happy with. So we shall see what we come across. Um, I do have the rare flowers on me now, so we can always try that method. Um, if we come across another Pteranodon to see if we can get it to aggro at us. The only issue with that, the only issue with that, with the rare flower angle, is that not only will the Pteranodon aggro at us, but everything will aggro at us. So that's kind of sketchy. This is actually kind of cool. That could be super helpful. All right, we'll keep that guy in mind. It's only a level 100, but... That's a good thing and a bad thing. The good thing is we can actually probably get it knocked out pretty easily. So we'll leave that guy there because that is something we need. We need a Dodic, we need an Anklo. Those are huge up on our list of things we need. Um, Titan Boa, the, the Prime Titan Boa, those are pretty huge. They're kind of hard to tame, but those give passive resources that we need of the, uh, the Venom. Titan bow of venom. So all interesting things. Anyway, let me go on the hunt. We'll see what we can find. All right, guys, we got another alpha pteranodon. It's actually really close by our base. Um, let's see if we can aggro it. No, 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 no. All right, let's eat a whole bunch of those. So we got our aggro, aggro for a while. Is it, is it coming after us? Oh, it is, it's working. It's working. Oh my goodness, this is epic. Um, I hope it's epic. I hope. Th this could also be really bad. All right, all right, Dillo, Dillo, come here. All right, all right, come here. Um, yo. Holy crap. All right, what's going on at the Torpor, Sitch? All right, dude, this is actually gonna work. I can't believe it, we're geniuses. We are total geniuses. All right, come on. Oh man, oh man, come on, no, 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 no. All right, um, I think it's running because it's high in torque, or maybe. Is that what's going on? Yeah, it is, That that's what's going on. All right, we gotta hurry, we gotta hurry. All right, come here, bro. Holy crap, where did it go? All right, is that it right there? Oh, it's so close. Is this it? Yep, 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 that's it, that's it, come here, come here, oh man, see this is where it gets so tricky, I don't know if there's anything we can do, come on, get mad at me, bro, get mad at me, oh, oh, yeah, 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 it's getting mad again, all right, come on, um, all right, all right, ate a bunch more, so it stays mad, come on, yes, 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 it's working, um, it might also be because it's torpor went down. All right, we're gonna try the shocking shenanigans now. And say, oh, no! Crap, Nuggets! Oh, man, that guy can hit hard. All right, um, I think, oh, crap, I think we should be okay. I think all of our stuff, come on! Gravestone work! Are you kidding? I went to Froggy's bed, that's why. Um, who? All right, I hope that delay in time didn't hurt us. All right, Dillo. All right, we got them both. Let's make sure they're healed. All right, they're all they're all safe. They're all okay. Oh lordy, that was sketchy. 
All right, let's pick him up. All right, sweet. Let's get our armor back on. Let's see here. All right, beautiful. Everything looks good. Let's just drop all these skins. Let me actually turn that option back off. I had it on for early game. No, where is it? Options. Is it there? Let's see. Give survivor items. There we go. All right. Beautiful. 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 All right. So where the crap was he? I think it was just right up over here. I thinks. I thinks. Is that him? It's probably already lost all of his torpor. I believe that is him. Yes. Oh, no. It's still got torpor. All right. Perfect. Um, where's our flowers? What the crap? Okay. All right, all right. Is it coming after us? Oh, we look like the alpha now. All right, where the crap is he? Where'd you go, bro? Did you get scared and run away? That is not him. Oh, man. That delay right there messed it all up for us. Where in the crap is it? All right, I think I found it. I think I found it. Um, Let's do it again. Put a whole bunch of those on. Awesome. Come here, bro. All right, that is the one. 320. Perfect. Perfect. Come on. Yup, yup. It's aggro. I'm pretty sure it's lost all the torpor by now. Yup, every last little bit. I wonder if I could do it on my animal instead. Ah, oh, crap. All right, all right, go, go, go. Throw that off. Quick, get on the Dillo. All right. Holy crap. Um, Let me see if I can shock him. Did the shock thing work? All right, I definitely hit him. Oh, that torpor is high. Come on. What is going on with his weapon? All right, we got him. We got him. All right, we got to get out of here. We got to leave the area because things are going to be aggroing at me probably. All right, um, um, there we go. Doing okay. Just don't lose your torpor, bro. Don't lose your torpor. Yeah, see how everything's mad at me? Oh, it's going to be mad at me for a while. All right. All right. Let's just get this dodo, and then we should be in the clear, I think. Come here, dodo. All right, all right. Anybody else coming for me? All right, I think we're good. All right, and it takes Dodo Kibble. All right, team up, bro, team up. Oh my goodness, we might get an Alpha Pteranodon. I can't believe this method works. He's so good, we're at 100% efficiency. It took one bite, all right, it's gonna take a little bit longer. Um. All right, we're just gonna do it. Now, you know what, I'm debating, guys, of removing a lot of these pastes from this season. Just because there's stuff that does the same thing. Great, he ate all my kibble. There's stuff that does the same exact thing already in Extinction. And it's a little bit harder there, but that's part of the grind of Extinction. You know, that's kind of important. So I, I kind of feel like you guys let me know if we should remove them. We can just block them from the I and I files. So I, I definitely think that would probably make the season a little bit harder, but also more fun. Um, anywho... Oh, crap. No, that's the Dillo. <laughs> can we do it? Yes, it does work. We can put a normal saddle on an alpha. It's not going to get the alpha boost yet. But, hey. Wow, we got an alpha Pteranodon, guys. Oh, my goodness. I wasn't sure if it was going to happen. This is so amazing. I totally love it. Wow. You know what? <laughs> In this mod, they still can't walk backwards. That's how old it is. Every Pteranodon from every mod does that now. But anyway, let's see. Spin. How long till I can spin again? All right. It's not that bad. Um, Let's see for the hits. What is it going to hit for? That's on a turtle that might be mate boosted. All right. Come on. It's still not that strong. But you know what? We don't have the alpha boost from the saddle. So that is what we need to work towards. That is going to be so important. All right, how are we doing? I mean, these guys are doing virtually nothing to us. They hit us for two damage. All right, come on, guys. All right, so we're going to have to get this guy leveled up. That is for sure, for certain. But let's see how expensive it is to get that saddle. If that's a thing that we can do. 
But look at that, starting off at 60,000 in the health. Amazing. Um, well, let's also boost that melee up already. All right, Alpha Pteranodon Saddle. What do you cost? All right, so we need to get, ooh, 345 Prime Hide and 115 Chitin. We already have the Emerald that's required, so that's cool at least. But the others are gonna be our bottleneck. So we'll we'll get working towards that. Um, I do recall Therizinosaurs can harvest way more resources um, of the prime hide, prime kite, and all that sort of thing. So that might be something we want to work towards. Um, that would just be a huge advantage for us. Um, also, let's go ahead and get this on it immediately, and let's get the pickup matrix on it. Sweet. And I don't. I think we need the level up counter too on this one. All right, epic, epic, epic. All right, so how are we doing now? All right, huge upgrade. Way, way, way big upgrade. Come here, dude. Oh, I wish you could spin more often faster. It's much bigger than a normal Pteranodon though. Look at, it's bigger than the trike. Oh, hello, you're still hitting me. Come on, bro. Let's -a go, let me get you. All right, epic, epic, epic. Let's get this up. Um, higher stamina, I mean, higher everything. And then it also gets better boost. It still is not the highest alpha in the world, but it's something. It's something, a 320 pre-tame. I mean, you, you can't get much better than that. You can't be much happier than that. All right, come on, dodos. Get a few little goodies from these guys. Nice. Oh, I'm loving them. It definitely feels better than a normal Pteranodon, though. Definitely worlds better. All right, well, I mean, I guess while these guys are here, this is some prime hide. We need 345 of it. Yikes, look at them all. Coming out of the woodworks. Let's go, bros. Nice. All right. Dude, they spawn so much. This alpha one is a toughie. We gotta get all of his buddies gone so he loses the alpha. All right, sweet. How are we doing so far? 11, yeah. So this is gonna be a little bit of a grind, but we'll get there, guys. We will get there. Um, Let's boost this up higher, melee up higher. It'll help us go faster. Let's see what we're hitting for now with the normal pack. All right, we're getting up there. We're moving up in the world. Why do I feel like the other Tranodon did way more, though? I don't know. We'll see. Let's see here. Turtles might resist, but 2,000. I swear the other Tranodon was hitting for like 10,000. I just don't know. I just don't know. All right. Anyway. Moving on. 3,000. Oh, we got an alpha. All right. Perfect. Get that boosted up more. And you know what else? Do we have any... Crap, do I not have my XP? Oh, I do. All right, let's give him an XP potion too. Ooh, and I got some small XP vials. So we can hurry this along. All right, epic. Come on, levels. They'll come in in a second. Nice. All right, let's get all these little turds and then we'll get that alpha turtle. Hopefully it won't be too big of a deal, but it might take a while. All right, doing good, everybody done? All right, and get that up there, beautiful. And let's do another one of those. Oh, hello, bro, come on, come on. Yep, still not hitting all that hard. All right, and, ooh, they keep on giving them to me. All right, here we go, turtle. What does the turtle have for health? Please don't be that much. All right, it's not that bad, it's only like 20,000. It's a low level one. All right, so this is gonna not gonna be a problem at all. All right, come on, bro, and got him! And he gave us a sapphire, beautiful. And that also gave us the keratin chitin, which we do need a good amount of. So that's super important as well. Those two things is what we're focusing on. All right, moving up in the world. Let's go find some more alphas, some more primes. Oh, and let's try and get at least the alpha saddle for this guy today. That would make me oh so happy. Nice. Whoa, look at all these beavers. Beaver over spawn just, just a tad little bit, huh, maybe? 
Holy cow. That is nuts. Absolutely nuts. Anyway, I'm gonna grind out, guys, and I will see you back. All right, guys, I'm not sure how I feel about this. We've got a skeletal Triceratops, but it only has 12.3K health, which doesn't seem like a lot. And I if I remember correctly, these guys, yeah, we, sh we should be okay. These guys give tons and tons and tons of the primal keratin chitin. So yeah, we definitely wanna go after this. I hope those aren't zombie dodos. All right, we got them. Oh, did this, are, are these zombie dodos? Yes, they are. Oh man, I think they harvested the body and got the, the keratin. I didn't notice I got any. All right, these dumb zombies. Ooh, come on, let me up. Our stamina is almost gone. All right, let's, let's show up here for a moment. Let's just see, did we get anything? Oh, you know what, we did get stuff. So we got a ruby, we got these different costume stuff, and did we get, no, it doesn't look like we got more of that. That kind of stinks. We did get some decent levels. Okay, I'll take that. I will a take of that. All right, well, we're moving along. Um, I did a single health boost in this guy, and it it's not substantial what they get for health. So I'm actually gonna stay away from that for a little bit. But yeah, let's keep on a grinding. Ooh, a Bronto, that will give us some nice XP. Yeah, we're one shot in Brontos now. We are golden. All right, guys, I'm making out pretty gosh darn well. I think we have all the hide that we need, more than enough. We just gotta get this prime chitin slash keratin. So we got another bone, dude. Let's see if we can get more from this one. I think the, the last one we did, I'm pretty sure we got robbed. Come on, by the dodos. Oh, you get way more if you harvest it by hand. That's the big kind of secret. Oh, but I don't know if we're gonna be able to do that without the dodos stealing the kill. All right, all right, can we, can we do it without? Oh man, you know what, let's just do it like this. All right, we got 32 that way. We only need like a little over 100. So that might be doable. What the heck is this? What are you, bro? Is that a little Jerboa? Bone Jerboa. That's so cool. All right, nice. We got another seven. Again, we'd be getting way more if we harvest it by hand. Um, oh, Bone Wyvern, that's kind of sketchy. I don't think that's something I want to mess with. Oh, no sorry, Bob. All right, let's just see, what what's its deal? Damn. That's like a, that's that's a way high, oh, it's only 60, but look at that, it's almost 70,000 health. That is way more health than anything else. All right, so we can also look for just any of the things that drop keratin chitin, like a an alpha tri uh, trike or, or stego or any of those type of things, a mantis. So that's why I think going over in the desert is probably the smarter way of doing it, but we're staying away from that wyvern. Bone wyvern, very scary. All right, anything else? Ooh, there's Xenosaur. See, this is what's gonna really help us. Even, what is that? This is actually good. I wanna see what he eats. So Megaloceros um, kibble. All right, that's cool. We can also use vegetables. And that could be a possibility. So we'll probably go hunting for one of those tomorrow. I'd be even happy with a vanilla one. Like that is one of the huge tickets to success on Extinction Cores, getting that Therizinosaur. So we'll look into that. Anyway, um, and then also, there's like special kangaroos, I think, that give more. <gasps> look, it's a tribe person. Let's go after him. Please don't get me. Oh, look at that. We got a call to arms, epic. That's very cool. We'll talk more about what that stuff does in a later episode. Let's see, anything. I just want to get the dang saddle, bro. Just want to get the dang saddle. And there is not too much alphas out. Now, pro tip, it's actually easier to hunt for alphas during the night, because you can see their glow from so much further away. Look at all these little ants. Get out of here, bro. But we're doing really good on our Pteranodon. It's hitting pretty hard now. Ooh, is that an alpha by any chance? Yes! All right, thorny uh, dragons are actually a pre, ooh, ooh, a good creature for doing torpor and getting knockouts. So that's actually kind of a cool thing too. 
Are we safe here? All right, I gotta take the chance and hop off. We've gotta get this. All right, come on, be enough. Uh, 18. All right, that wasn't as great as I was hoping for, but hey, that's 18 nonetheless. All right, what are we up to? I think we needed like 100. Let's just see if we can look it up. All right, we need 115, but we do have the prime hide. So we're almost there, guys. We are so close to being there. We will get it. Oh, look at you, bro. That would be super helpful in getting more, too. Alpha Sabers. But I will take you for your hide for now. And this guy, I couldn't jump off to harvest him by hand on the last one. But this one we should be able to. I can't even see what level it is. I don't know why Ark does that. Why do we have this huge level up thing on the top of the screen? It could be so much smaller. I don't know what, what possesses these people. Oh, crap. Oh, well. So we got more emeralds. That's cool. We're getting a lot of the resources that we need, guys. A real lot of them. Call to arms, which is epic. We'll be able to make some uh, tripaths with them. So that's pretty cool. Ooh! Wow! Look at the levels we got. I did not even notice that. Cheesy peeds. Our pteranodon is going to be baller. All right, sweet. Moving on up in the world. Moving on up in Deedee. All right, so close, guys, so close. Let's just get one more good thing. Come on. Another thorny dragon. Another something. Those aren't alphas. Get smashed. What are we hitting for now? Almost 30,000. All right, that's cool. Cool enough for me. A Carno would work. Unfortunately, the tribe guys don't give anything. But anyway, I'm going to keep on hunting. We will find us something. All right, we got another thorny dragon. All right, come on, baby. Give me some goodies. Um, Can I harvest you off my mount? Oh, stop putting your axe away, bro. Ooh, that was a good one, I think, too. All right, that gave us 15 more. Oh, we are so close. Not quite enough. Just a few more. All right, I think this is it. There's one more just a little bit further down. Oh, there's a lot of scariness here. All right, we got him. We got him. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And... Oh, we got 33 on that one. I think that's enough. Yes, it is enough, guys. It is enough. Let's get back to the base. Let's go make that saddle. Holy crap. I cannot believe it. That was a grind getting it. But it is going to be so well worth it. I cannot tell you enough how important it is that we get this saddle. All right, so let's grab that. Let's grab that. And let's also just grab this stuff out while we're here. Beautiful. Let's a toss of these. Now, we're not, unfortunately, to upgrade these saddles, like at least anything substantial, it is going to be so ungodly pricely, uh, pricey. But we can we can upgrade it a little bit. All right, so here... Yeah, we got it. We're just short in the fiber. Not a problem. Beautiful. All right, next up, I have been grinding out a whole bunch of polymer from the mantis while I've been leveling up. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's actually pull the legit stuff back out. I don't want to use that. All right, so now that we got that going on, while I can't upgrade it, so to speak, I can augment it. So we can go ahead like this, and we can get something more out of it than just what the base level was, which I didn't take notice of what it was. All right, so 240 is the highest it will allow us to go. And I think that's good enough for augments. I don't want to use up all of my polymers. We'll save that for another time. Beautiful. All right. Let's go replace the saddle. So it's not quite as much armor yet. But we're going to get a lot of other abilities. All right. So now with the saddle, we get this little thing up here that gives us boosted stats. So let's see what those boosted stats actually mean. So in fact, hold on. We will put this right back on in just a second. Let me just uh, see what were we hitting for at max with this saddle first. Let's see if we can find somebody. Come on, bros. Come at me. 
All right, here we go. This guy's definitely not mate boosted. So doing a hit of 15,000, which is pretty reasonable. 15,000, let's do the spin on this guy. And 30,000 on the spin. All right. So that's with the normal saddle. Let's now take off the normal saddle. Let's put on the alpha saddle. All right. So now we're hitting for 17 epic and the spin 35. So we got a 5,000 boost on that. That's pretty respectable. I'll be honest with you, I was expecting more than that, but it's it's still an extra 5,000. And you gotta realize, in Extinction Core, this is not a mod where the guys, everything hits for like a million. This is pretty big damage. You know, pretty respectable damage. You can see some stuff resists us. But we are not gonna have to worry about that any much else. Remember that Wyvern I was scared of had like 70-ish thousand health? We're gonna be able to knock him out in two hits, two spins. So, I mean, that's huge. That is a huge upgrade. Plus, that's not the only stats that get better. I believe probably our resistance and stuff goes up as well. So, pretty sweet. I dig it. Anyway, guys, we had a pretty good day today. Seriously, I can't believe we were able to figure out a way to tame the Alpha Pteranodon solo. That is so crazy, incredibly cool. Anyway, guys, I think it's now that time. Let's go name those dinos. All right, guys, I just finished going through the comments, and yes, it is that time. That's right, time to name the dinos. For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go through the comments of the previous episode, and I pick out all the most awesomest name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there. That's right, just remember, if you want to have a chance at getting your name chosen, you got to be a subscriber, so smash that subscribe button. You got a comment down below. It is just that easy. Anyway, for today, we have our very best Pteranodon, Vanilla Pteranodon to name and our Alpha Dilo. So without any further ado, we have Whirlwind, epic name for the Pteranodon, and we have a throwback name to, I think the last time maybe we played Extinction Core? Probably, but the name is Mr. Spitster. I love it. Such an epic name for him. Mr. Spitster. Love it. Anyway, next episode we'll be naming the Alpha Patera. So we'll see what epic and awesome names you guys come up with. But anyway, guys, thank you oh so much for watching. It's been a pleasure. As always, show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe for the Daily Arc Awesomeness. And as always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks again and peace out.